which is a memorial to Irish immigrants that came over after or during or after the great Irish potato famine of 18, 1845 to 1852 and you can see here that this park was opened by H. E. Mary McAleese, President of Ireland on June 21st, 2007 and it's a very touching memorial that actually features the names of Irish settlers engraved onto the side walls of these stones here. Very, very touching. What's even more touching are these uh, figures here, sculptures that have been created to commemorate the suffering of these poor uh, and emaciated Irish immigrants that came over in the mid 1850s or mid 1800s. And you can see these uh, sculptures are very, very graphic, illustrating the uh, dire conditions that these immigrants were in. Obviously, a favorite destination of the photographers. Pregnant woman. One of the sculptures in the back is the Canada Malting Company, an industrial relic at the waterfront of Toronto. So many waterfronts in the 1800s were purely industrial, they were not recreational. But you can see a lot of that has changed. None of this is industrial anymore on this side. What a gorgeous um, view of downtown Toronto from here. Some of the tour boats uh, are parked here. The Jubilee Queen I can see here in this area. Great view of the uh, CN Tower. And a look over here to the Toronto Islands. Wonderful spot here at Ireland Park.